to talk to you now about um, a module I'm doing this term. It's nearly over. I mean, I've been, this is February now, and I've been doing this module since the beginning of January when I got back at Christmas. And it's called Nursing Practice 2, well, Learning Disability Nursing Practice 2. I did the first nursing practice in the first year, um, um, but I want to talk about this one because I'm, I'm, well, I'm really enjoying it and I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, so they covered some really interesting things um, that really excited me and interested me and made me feel really inspired to just get out there and you know, we've been learning about health needs and you know, additional needs of people with disabilities and you know, so we've had lessons on mental health, we've had lessons on you know, people with learning disabilities and mental health problems, dual diagnosis, we've had lessons on autism, challenging behaviour, epilepsy, genetics in LD, um, NEAD which is non-epileptic attack disorder, we've had lessons on physiology in an LD context, we've had physiology of diabetes, physiology of respiration, we've done some skill sessions, we've done catheter care, we've had lessons on dysphagia, um, where a speech and language therapist from practice came to talk to us about that. We've had an older adult, we've had an older adult specialist nurse come from practice, we've had a continence nurse specialist come out from, from practice to talk to us. Um, so it's been really interesting though, it's, and it's all been you know, LD specific, so it hasn't been core, no, it hasn't been with the adult nurses and the child nurses, it's just been the LD group together, you know, learning entirely LD stuff, and that's that's really good. Um, uh, what else have we done? No, really, no, it's really interesting stuff. Um, modules nearly over, but it stop. It stops next at the end of next week. You can go on placement in two weeks' time. Um, so yeah, I've I've loved it really. It's been my favourite module of uni so far easily, um, just because it's you know it's it's all LD. Not that I don't enjoy stuff that isn't all LD, but I prefer stuff that is simply, um, you know. So and this being 100% LD is it's really good, and we can all. You know, when, when we're talking about epilepsy, we all reflect on stuff we've done in the past. Like, you know, someone might tell a story about someone who's had a seizure out in practice and what they did and what they saw and you know, what they might do in the future and following what they've learned in class. You know, and you're always having discussions and debates and really interesting. Um, they're really, really interesting. Um, the assignment for the module is a viva, which is called, um, which translates to, I think maybe it's Latin or something. It's a live voice. So I have to do a presentation which is recorded. Um, but that isn't until May, so it's a couple of months away after placement, so I'm not too worried about that right now. Um, but I'm sure I will be. I'm not really the biggest fan of public speaking, but I'm getting there with it. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say that, you know, if you're a first year and you're watching this and you've heard about Nursing Practice 2, definitely, you know, you've got something to look forward to. It's, it's really good. Really, really, really good. And if you're a prospective student, then, you know, the first year obviously is core. Um, you know, get through year one and you know, year two is you know, where it starts to get good with the field specific stuff, definitely. So um, that's it, really. But no, yeah, look forward to it, guys. But um, yeah, more blogs coming up. So I'll see you soon. Bye.